This video is about uploading files to LiveBinders. There are two ways to upload your files to LiveBinders. One is if you're going to upload multiple files, and the second is if you're just going to upload a single or a couple of files, and you can do that from inside the binder. First, I'm going to show you how to upload multiple files. So from your dashboard, click on My Uploaded Files and you'll get to this page that has all your files and their file sizes here. If you click on Upload Your Files, click on Add Files, and then just browse to the files that you want to add. I can select multiple files if I want here. Then I need to start the upload. And you can watch the progress here and when it reaches 100% you will see your files down here. Now if I want to add these to a binder, I just click on the files that I want to add and then click on Add to Binder. And what this does is bring up three copies of the Live Binder It window and each copy of the Live Binder It window has one of my files in it. So from here I can add my files to any of my binders and I can put them in a tab or a subtab, or I can add those files to a new binder. And I add them one at a time through each of these different live binder it's. Now if I just want to upload a single file, the easiest way to do that is inside the binder. Click on Edit Menu, click on Upload File, and then you're going to browse to the file that you want to upload click on Open, and then click on Upload. And that file will appear here in your binder. Now, now this file is a GIF image, JPEG images, uh, PDFs will all appear inside your binder. If your file is a Word document or a PowerPoint, those will appear as a link, and when somebody clicks on that link, those files will be downloaded to their local computer. So if you actually want it to show up in the binder, it's better to output it as a PDF or you can use Google Docs and put the link in the binder. So that's how you upload files to LiveBinders.